Hi everyone. This is part of the series How to From EMK Global Education and Migration, where we will share with you quick tips to study, work and migrate to Australia. In this video, you will learn how to apply for an Australian Federal Police AFP, clearance check online. An AFP clearance certificate is required when you apply for most of Australian provisional and permanent visas if you are 16 or older. So now, let's check it out. The first step is to search for the right link to apply online. Go to Google and key in the words AFP check. Then click on the right link. There are many different third-party websites that look similar to the AFP website. Make sure you go to the authentic and original link, otherwise, you might have to pay a service fee or you cannot get the right clearance check. The correct website is the one with the Australian Federal Police logo. From the front page, you can see the word national police checks and what you have to apply for is this one, $42 for each national police check application from a government department or an individual. You can find the application completion guide here. Click online application then there will be a new window pop up with the URL. The correct link will direct you to the online portal where you can see the AFP logo and the words national police check and PC online application form. Read the instructions and understand them. Scroll down then tick the box I have read and understood the instructions above. Then go to the next step. Please tick all your available documents to complete the 100 points for identification documents. For example, most people have their passport, birth certificate. But be cautious that for the birth certificate, you need to submit the original copy with English translation that includes the information of the NADI accredited translator. Some other documents are also accepted such as driver's license, bank statement, national identity card, etc. as long as you have enough 100 points to satisfy the identity check. Anyways, most of the requested documents must have already been handy, so please take it easy. If you have enough 100 points, let's go to the next step. In the applicant details, make sure that you type your full name correctly. Your full name should include your middle name as well. Be careful if your name is longer more than two words. For example, your full name is Duong Tran Hong An. You can type your family name as Duong but given names, you have to type Tran Hong An. It should not be Tran Hong or Hong An. Then your date of birth. You input your email address and the purpose of this Australian police check. In this scenario, the AFP check is used for the purpose of applying a visitor or graduate visa 485. So you choose Commonwealth Employment, Purpose and Code 33, Immigration, Citizenship for supply to the Department of Home Affairs. Then you click the next button. In this section, you must upload your identity documents. You must scan your identification documents prior to starting the online application process. Scanned files must be in JPG, PDF or TIFF format, with each file being no more than 4 megabytes in size. Please ensure your scanned files are legible or the processing of your NPC application cannot proceed. After uploading all your needed documents, please remember to click the Upload Files button to complete the progress. Then your supporting documents will be uploaded to the website of Australian Police Check. In this step, you have to fill out your current address in Australia, street name, town, state, postcode. However, if you forget your address start date, you can write the first day of the month. It's okay. If your current postal address is the same as your current residential address, you should tick in the same as current residential address line. The next section is about your previous residential addresses. Many people have moved house quite frequently, so they have a lot of living addresses to fill out. The next section is to confirm the details. In this section, you have to review all your information already filled out. Please check it carefully and then click the box below if you have read and uploaded the necessary documents. Then the final step is about the payment. Please have your credit card ready and fill out necessary payment information to complete the AFP check. Then AFP will immediately send you an acknowledgement email with the payment receipt like this. You can see the amount of fee you have paid is $42. Please be careful that if you click confirm payment, no further changes to your application will be allowed. After completing your payment you will get your NPC reference number. You should save your reference number in case they don't send you the payment receipt or it went to the spam box. So, you can show them your reference number to confirm and use the number to apply free visa. After your application is submitted, 
Your police check will be processed in approximately 7 to 10 days. In some cases, it might take a bit longer. When your AFP check is completed, you will receive an email with the subject line AFP National Police Check Application Processed. Your AFP certificate will be dispatched via Australia Post and the postage times are between 3 to 7 working days. This is a sample of the AFP clearance certificate. That's it. All done now. We hope this video is helpful and you can apply for the AFP police check by yourself now. If you need assistance in applying for a police check, an Australian visa or advice on migration to Australia, feel free to contact our professional team at contact at mglobal.com.au or call plus 61. 487-026-666. Our contact details of all branch offices are on the screen. See you in the next video. Goodbye for now.